Richard Scarry's Busy Town from Wikipedia, the free encyclopedia, at en.wikipedia.org. Richard Scarry's Busy Town is a Sega Genesis and MSDOS video game that was released for a younger generation of gamers. This game was based on the television show The Busy World of Richard Scarry that was produced by Cenar and Paramount Television. Gameplay. The game consists of an interactive storybook that was written by Richard Scarry. Most of the game is spent exploring Busy Town, looking for things to interact with using either the gamepad or a special mouse that could be purchased separately from the game and the council system. Young gamers will do everything from building things to delivering something to repair a ship. Games are relatively short and can be finished in about an hour. Familiar faces from Richard Scarry's works of literature include Huckle Cat and Lowly Worm. There is also a game where the player controls the wind and can cause controlled havoc at the city park. All games offer basic vocabulary practice as simple puzzles help improve basic problem solving and English language skills. The voice quality of this game is realistic when compared to the cartoons of that era. All the characters act and talk like their counterparts in the books and the cartoon series. If the player puts too much lemonade or soda in the glass and spills some out of the glass, then one of the characters asks the player, Are you blind? in a gentle voice. Delivering stuff allows the town to slowly come to life. Sequel There is a sequel for this game titled Richard Scarry's How Things Work in Busy Town, which received a 1994 North American exclusive release from Pearson Software and Sipen and Shuster. Like the original game, it is intended for a pre-kindergarten through second grade audience and was released for the MSDOS in addition to the Macintosh. Children that play this game learn to assemble machinery, bake bread, and complete other processes that are necessary to live life. This game makes kids think where food comes from, how bread is baked, and so on. Different outcomes can be observed through the several different learning methods. Young players can also learn vocabulary, word recognition, and sequencing. This sound file and all text in the article are licensed under the GNU Free Documentation License, available at www.gnu.org slash copyleft slash fdl.html.